Chronic kidney disease, also known as CKD, affects more than 35 million U.S. adults, and most are undiagnosed. Let's talk about the importance of screening for and treating patients with CKD. CKD means that the kidneys are damaged and can cause other problems such as heart disease and anemia. CKD is a common complication of diabetes. In fact, approximately one in three adults with diabetes develops CKD. Besides diabetes, other risk factors for CKD include having high blood pressure, heart disease, overweight or obesity, and a family history of CKD. CKD doesn't have symptoms until it reaches advanced stages, so it's important to screen patients who have risk factors for CKD. Don't wait for signs. Check early with simple blood and urine tests if the risk is there. Treatment options have improved in recent years, and a lot can be done early on to protect patients' health. Earlier screening allows you to start the right treatment sooner, helping prevent or delay CKD, heart disease, and kidney failure. The sooner a patient is screened, the sooner action can be taken to prevent CKD progression. Some medications available to treat patients with CKD are ACE inhibitors, ARBs, SGLT2 inhibitors, and GLP-1 receptor agonists. For people with diabetes, blood pressure and glucose-lowering medications can help prevent or delay CKD. These medicines also reduce protein in the urine, which is a key risk factor for CKD progression. Providers are the first line in identifying and managing CKD. Timely testing and treatment can reduce complications and save lives. Early diagnosis matters. Know the risk factors and prioritize CKD screening for your patients today. Learn more at cdc.gov slash ckd slash screening.